Hi friends! Today we're going to talk about the Worldwide Write-a-thon and the schedule and what you can expect. <laughs> majority of this video is going to be a voiceover, just an FYI. I do have some infographics and some things that I would like to show you, so I will be doing a voiceover um, for the majority of that, but basically I just wanted to say if you are not familiar with the World Ride write thon it is a write thon that I put together sometime last year. It's kind of evolved from the original 12-hour uh, sprint relay that's now a 48-hour worldwide write thon I believe we went from 12 to 24 to 36 and now we're at 48 hours. There are 18 writing sprints and I believe eight chat sprints, maybe only seven. I think there's eight. This round we're also having a fundraiser and a dance party and we'll talk about all of that as we go through the schedule. There are games that can be played. We have uh, bingo board options. I have a surprise for you guys that we're going to talk about a little bit later. Just a lot of things going on. We do basically run this off of Discord. So if you have not joined us on Discord and you would like to be involved in either as a host or a co-host in the future, or if you're a participant and you want to just have all of the information at the earliest time possible, then you should join us on Discord because that is where we primarily do all of the things. I do first and foremost want to say that I do thank you all so much for joining me on this weird and wild adventure of hosting these write-a-thons. Basically every time it has changed we've changed the way that we schedule or we've changed the way um, that the hosts do things and it, it's kind of just evolving over time and I it's not something I could do without you guys. I'm really just an organizer. I'm here to organize the event, put things together. That being said, I could not do any of that without Sam. Writing Mom Samantha El Nasset, her channel will be linked down below. Um, she is my behind the scenes admin deity. She is the one who does all of the things pretty much on Discord. I think it was her original suggestion was that we move to Discord and I was like, I don't understand it. And she's like, I'll help you out. Um, and she does and she's amazing and wonderful and all of my hosts and co-hosts have always been wonderful I've been very happy um, the mix of people that we've had each time It seems like we've got like about a 50 50 of new people versus people that are coming back So I'm really enjoying that as well um, And then a lot of participants so enjoying it very excited Let's get to the schedule and all of those things now Okay, y'all, we're going to start off with a presentation style of our schedule for the event. So again, Worldwide Write-A-Thon, June 4th through the 6th, all times are in Eastern Daylight Time. If you do need to look up um, what that time zone is for you, I do recommend the website worldtimebuddy.com. That seems to be the best, most accurate one that I have found because you can set it by the date as well as by time zone and it accounts for daylight savings time in whatever time zone either you're in or we are in to offset that issue for you. Other things that we should always remember is don't forget, be polite to your hosts and other participants. Take plenty of breaks. I know we have half hour breaks built in as well as I believe an hour break after the dance, but you should definitely be taking more breaks than just that. You should get some sleep. It's important. Drink plenty of water. Do not stress about your productivity. Yes, it is a weekend for productivity, but if you don't reach your goals, it's totally fine. Anything that you get is more than what you started out with, and the main goal is to have fun. This event is made for all of us to kind of get together, celebrate the art of writing, and, you know, if you're reading or doing chores or working on school projects or whatever it is that you happen to be doing, all of that is absolutely acceptable. Uh, the main thing is to communicate with one another, to learn more about each other, and to build this community that I have grown very fond of. And the community is why I started this write-a-thon, because I love 
this community. Page two gets us to the actual schedule. We start off up here at 6 p.m. again, Eastern Daylight Time with me on my channel. There will be linked in the description box down below both a playlist for the sprint streams as well as the chat streams. I did separate them this year as requested. That way you could have playlists open on two separate tabs and run them concurrently. That was a request you all had, so I made that happen. It's not hard, but I made it happen anyway because I am a giving deity and that's how I roll. We will probably chat for 20 minutes to a half hour in this kickoff. It's basically just to say, hey, how y'all doing? Do you have any final last minute questions? What can I do for you? here I am. As I go through this list, I'm mostly just going to be saying people's first names, but you can see the whole name on here. At 7 p.m., we're going to go over to Holly's channel for sprints, and then at 9 p.m., Kayla will be hosting a chat on her channel. We would then will go to sprints with Heather at 9.30, and then sprints hosted by Grape Fry, aka Devesha, and that's going to be our break into Saturday at midnight. Then sprints with Katie Ann, a chat with Stephanie, sprints with Azaria, sprints with Stieg, which I will be awake and alive for and on screen for. Yeah, right. And then a chat with Jacqueline. Page three brings us to something else you guys requested, a NaNoWriMo fundraiser. During the last couple of events, you all have asked about doing a fundraiser for NaNoWriMo during the event. It's very difficult to do because you actually have to have a, I, I don't know what the threshold of, of subscribers is, but it's a fairly high threshold of subscribers, but our resident neighborhood Kate Cavanaugh does indeed have enough subscribers to host a fundraiser. So she so very kindly offered to do sprints for us and make that a NaNoWriMo fundraiser event. I will also be on screen for that event. Sleep. It's for the week. After our fundraiser event, we will then hop over to Sam's channel. Sam is our other Discord deity, and she will be hosting sprints at 12.30. And then Julie's channel at 3. And then Glory will be having a chat. And then sprints with Sarah. At 8 p.m., our other Discord deity, Sam, will also be hosting a dance party. This is Sam's reward for all of the behind-the-scenes work that she does. She discussed wanting to have a dance party, and I went, you want a dance party? You control the dance party. So Sam gets to uh, be rewarded for work by doing more work and also dancing on screen in front of all of you. Uh, so we will have a dance party. I believe she's going to plan on running until 10. It may be 11. I'm not sure. She's allowed to do as she pleases. After the dance party, when you're ready to work again, we'll be headed to Portia's channel and then to Tasha's channel and then a chat with the lovely Emily at three in the morning. I will be asleep for that. And then for our final page of the schedule, uh, we will have sprints with Marta and then sprints with AS and then a chat with yours truly and then sprints with Caitlin, sprints with Nia at Vix and Fiction, and then sprints with Charlie, a chat hosted by Shay and sprints with Brooke to round us out at the end. I will then be doing a closing chat at 7.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. The closing chat is typically just for me to check in, see how everyone did, kind of get your feedback on how things went, if we could do things better than how we did them in the past, what you would like to change, what we can add. And this is also typically where myself or Sam will say fun things like, I liked the way things went this time, but we should completely change it next time, which is what typically happens. But uh, so far, you guys have been great with all of the changes that we make. So I've been very happy with that. That is our schedule for the event. Let's look at some other things. There are a couple of other small things that I did make for this year. Um, the first being a worldwide write-a-thon bingo board. 
Chada, we have one of those in collaboration with Glory from Glory Writes the Blues. She had a list of bingo prompts that they use on their regular streams. I have taken some of our prompts from Writeathon's past and then added some new ones in as well. And I will link down below the full list of prompts. And there is a website link in there where you can either auto generate what squares the prompts go on, or you can just choose them on your own. We are playing blackout bingo because I am the devil. And what I want you to do is blackout your bingo board. Is there a prize? Smug satisfaction, if that counts as a prize, but also there will be a surprise prize that we'll talk about here in a few minutes. It's not a real prize, but it's fine. It's a surprise prize and some of you will enjoy it and others of you will go, I'm not putting all of that work into blacking out a bingo board for that. It's all fun and games, y'all. In addition to the bingo board, we also have brought back the Worldwide Write-A-Thon Goals Story Template. Uh, there's a link in the description box down below for this entire Google Drive where it has all of the schedules, the infographics, the goal sheet, the bingo board, all of those things are there. Before we go into the surprise of the evening, there was also a request for us to tabulate everyone's word count for the write-a-thon. So I did make a Google form that will also be linked down below. And I just need you to put in your email and what your total words were during the write-a-thon. And then sometime during the week after, I will tabulate um, the total word count that we got during the write-a-thon. And I will post that both on our Instagram and in the Discord. Um, so that that's there as well, because that was something that y'all requested. And finally, you guys asked for some badges. So Jessica's going to give you badges. Uh, this was something that I was working on behind the scenes, and I wasn't sure that it was actually going to get done before the ride a thon So this, my friends, is your surprise. Uh, we have some that are very self-explanatory and some that I shall explain to you, but also in this lovely space right here, in this wonderful space right here, we also have uh, a description board for you because that's how I roll. So if you were a participant, a co-host, or a host, you get a badge. If you participated in a chat, you can have the social badge. If you were at the dance party, dance party badge. Uh, then we get a little tricky, but novice, if you attended four sprints, apprentice, if you attended eight sprints, and master, if you attended 12 sprints. Those are the actual writing sprints, not the chat sprints, my friends, but I'm not here to police you. So if you attend 12 sprints altogether and you want that master badge, you go ahead and take it. Philanthropist is for those of you who attend the fundraiser stream. You do not have to donate to get the philanthropist badge because just being there is enough for me. Bingo winner, that's what you win. If you black out your bingo board, you get a bingo winner. I know it's special. We're going to skip the badger for a minute. Down here on the bottom, we have 2,500 words, 5,000 words, 7,500 words, and 10,000 words. Those are all very self-explanatory. If you get more than 10,000 words, DM me via either my own Instagram or the World I'd Write-A-Thon Instagram or on Discord if you're over on Discord with us. And I will make you your own personalized one with your own number on it because I don't know that many of you are going to get more than 10,000, but I didn't know where the cutoff should be. So... I want you to be able to celebrate those wins, my friends. Also, if you're doing editing or reading or chores or studying or whatever the case may be, you let me know if you think you deserve a special badge for your accomplishments. And I will try to do my best to make that work for you. And then, my friends, we have the badger. The badger is for those of you who, like Becca C. Smith, loves all the badges. There are some special badges that I will also be handing out to those of us who are admin deities and also moderators. And there's some other things. There's some other secret badges that are not part of this collection. But if you collect at minimum 10 other badges, you, my friend, can have this amazing badger badge. Because the badger is a badge hunter and you can have a badger badge. This was born from me discussing badges with Sam and continuously having to change my words from badger to badge. And Sam said, makes sense, badge hunter. And I went, that's the prize for getting all the badges. You can also have a badger badge in the description box down below 
in the Google Drive form for all of the Worldwide write thon things, there will be a folder with all of these badges in them with transparent backgrounds because I am fancy. And you can post those wherever you would like to post them at, on your Instagram, on your website, on your Facebook, in your YouTube videos, whatever you want to do with them, they're yours forever. Let me know if you guys like these, if you think there's something that we could add, something that we could take away. What do you want to do next time? Who knows? Not me. You let me know. I'll try to make it happen as long as like more than three people want it to happen. All right, y'all, that is all I have. So I am going to send you back to my face. Thank you for joining me. So that is going to be it for me today. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns, please leave them in the comment section down below and I will try to help you out the best that I can. That is all I have for today. I post reading, writing, book, and planner related videos a couple of times a week. If you don't want to miss anything I have going in the future, make sure you hit the subscribe button and the notification bell down below. And until then, I will see you guys next time. Bye!